Dee da dee da dee dee do do. Dee da dee dee do. Dee da dee 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 dee. Okay, see if that looks good. Hello! I bet you were like, where did Lucas go? Where is he? I was just creeping over there. Got ya! Let's make some Taco Bell candles. You know you want a Taco Bell candle. Don't even lie. You've seen a candle before and been like, I want to eat that. I want that in my mouth. I want all that wax next to my teeth, on my tongue. You've thought it. Don't even deny. No point of lying, we're friends here. When I was little, I really wanted to eat soap. So me and my older sister ate soap wasn't good. Didn't taste very well. But I feel like we can make an edible candle that smells like Taco Bell and tastes like Taco Bell. If you're new here, subscribe. <laughs> because we do fun stuff around here. Okay. So I've never made a candle before and I Googled how to make a candle. There was a lot of stuff you had to buy and then I came across a link where it all just came together. Obviously I picked that route. I'm a lazy bitch. Thank God they make easy products like this for pathetic people like me. Just wanted to have a little shimmy break. So what you're gonna need for this DIY, you're gonna need all of this shit. There's a thermometer, the thing that holds the candle when it's done. Be sure to stop by your local Taco Bell. Taco Bell! Currently in the drive-thru line. Hello. Hello. Thank you so much. That felt like an advertisement, it wasn't. I just really like Taco Bell and I'm doing this for free. You need to get two items of your choice from Taco Bell. I did soft tacos, obviously. You're gonna use one for the candle and the other one, you're gonna eat. Mm. Chew the food while making this movement. These are soy flakes. I got the ones that are soy because I'm sure that's edible, right? Can you eat soy wax? Hopefully I'm not the only one who's ever wanted to eat a candle. Oh, Yahoo Answers. Somebody said, I eat wax all the time. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Hooray for trusting strangers on the internet for questions about health. We can eat the wax. There's been a lot grosser things that have been in my mouth. Now we've got to boil this. Get a pot with water in it. Drippy drip. Turn on the stove and wait for this to boil. While we wait for the water to boil, let me show you my two newest sex toys. Just kidding, you sick pervert. These are for dogs to lick out. These were made so dogs can lick the holes of this. They lick the hole. Why does that sound weird? They lick the hole, that's what they do. Why do I feel gross right now? Told ya. Oh look, it's boiling! Now you reduce the heat a tad and put the wax into the boiling mess! Now you wait for the soy wax that you can probably eat, according to a stranger online that might be trying to hurt us. You wait for the wax to melt in the pot while you sit on the pot! <laughs> That was dumb. Would you look at that? There's some juices forming. Whenever there's juices forming on anything, you know that something's going right. Stir it gently while it's melting. This is gentle stirring. Juices. 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 Ah. All right, we're back at the table. So the wax is all melted. Now I'm just gonna take my little candle canister, my bob, place that onto a safe towel. Make sure the towel is safe, because you don't want to burn your table and have your parents get mad. Kick you out of the house. Next thing you know, you're homeless, and your family never invites you to Christmas ever again. So lay down a towel, get your soft taco ready. So what we're gonna do is pour wax. Add some taco juices. Pour the wax. Add some taco juices, and repeat until it's full. Oh crap, I was supposed to put the wick down. Put the wick in the mid. Add some taco juices. Love the taco juices. Add some more taco insides. Add the intestines of the taco, the innards of the taco. Mmm. Ooh. Ba -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. That's not the right song. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm gonna have diarrhea in three hours. Look at that beauty. Mm -hmm. Now we just need for the wax to harden. Right when I'm done filming this video, I'm gonna make a whole batch of these and go door to door and sell them. Hey ma'am, you know why your marriage is failing? Because your house doesn't smell like a burrito. It's done! The wax is hardened. It's hard. It is no longer wet down in my undercarriage anymore. It's hard. Can we just appreciate this amazing creation? I'm so talented. Time to test this bish. I'm lighting the wick. It's burning. Bernie Sanders. <laughs> Come on, Candle, release your scent. Release your godly odors. 
I'm not gonna lie, right now it just smells like there's a fire. Something's burning. Bernie Sanders, <laughs> This doesn't smell like Taco Bell. I really feel like the world needed this. I'm smelling some vanilla. What the hell? Mmm. It smells like somebody's cooking sausage in here. It smells like somebody's cooking sausage too long. And it's starting to burn. Bernie Sanders. <laughs> Maybe this is why they don't make Taco Bell candles, because it'll just make your apartment smell like a fire. This smells like diarrhea. Whatever, I try. You want your house to smell like somebody's burning something, right? Like maybe a body's burning in the basement? It, it is, it's good. Oh, I have to taste it. Ow! Tasted like nothing. Ow! This is some cheese that's been in the wax. It just tastes like really disgusting cheese. Like cheese that's been sitting in an alley for two decades. Maybe somebody's taken a shit on it. Yeah, it tastes like Taco Bell. <laughs> it doesn't. It tastes like shit. Make this and give it to a person you hate. If you're dating someone and you want to break up with them, just make them a batch of these and they'll break up with you immediately. You'll be cut out of their life. You'll be dead to them. Turns out this DIY is just a really good revenge gift. All right, guys, give this video a thumbs up for Taco Bell candles. Leave a comment below of any other DIY you want to see me do. Something crazy. Don't forget to subscribe so you can know whenever I release a new video, which is every Wednesday and Sunday. And with... Out. And with that, I'm gonna dash out and continue to burn this candle. Just kidding. Ugh.